Okay. So good morning, teachers, students, and special invitees. My name is Adrian, and this is my partner, Carl. I, I welcome you to this presentation of this application software that could revolutionize the education industry. Um, today, my partner, Carl, and I will be describing to you this product and how we could change the way we learn in the classroom. And now we will show you the ad we made for the product for the pitch. Um, stating in the advertisement, teachers can have effective communication with their students using, using this application software to provide classwork efficiently, therefore ensuring maximum productivity. So why use our product? Why not use some pre-existing service on the internet like social media or email? Well, that's a good question. <laughs> well, our application runs off of specialized source code that enable it to display the classwork within a specified time. This ensures that the student completes work before it is erased from their digital device, um, which eliminates procrastination. Unlike other services that will create a permanent record of that classwork on the student's digital device and enable them to complete it at a later period, on which they could waste the time within the classroom. All right, so picture this. You're sitting in a classroom, you're all by yourself, time's ticking by, no teacher in sight. You're wondering to yourself, oh, so I wonder where the teacher is. So you go over, you talk to your friend, you open your phone, you start doodling on the desk. It's just a whole bunch of wasted time, all gone down the drain. So this is what our application's for. It was created solely as a solution to this problem where teachers are unable to attend the class and students engage in wasteful activities. So, with the implementation of this application, teachers will be able to telecommute with their students and ensure that they are engaging in more productive activities, making sure that they finish their work on time, making sure that they don't waste time on their phones, make sure they don't go over to different classes, dif try and distract other students, causing a whole different chain reaction. So. As you can see, we are currently in the midst of a revolutionary breakthrough in the education industry. With your help, we might just be able to actually achieve our goal of implementing this product and securing every child's future success. All right, I will be showing you some of the mock-ups for our software and explaining to you the key features that each one entails. All right, so our first mock-up shows the very first screen that you will see when you open the app. It's very simple. Try to utilize only the Queen's College colors of gold and black. So you can either go into the existing user or new user, depending on whether or not you've used the app before. 
fairly simple design, easy to use, easy to understand. Next, we have this slide, where the teachers will be able to actually make the document for the students to access during a specific time. You have the class and the subject, obviously, because you can't just make it on anywhere so that everyone gets confused about the work. There are the instructions and the actual assignment for the teacher to post the date and time available, date and time unavailable. Fairly self-explanatory. It's available between a certain amount of time. If you go before then, can't access it. If you go in after, can't access it. If it falls in between that time, you can find it. Here is what happens if the earlier situation occurs. Here, at the top, it says, sorry you were late by blank minutes. That's if you were too late. If you didn't, ma if you didn't make it in time, sucks for you. If you fall in the latter category, that means that you are a little bit too enthusiastic about getting your work done. You've made it a little bit too early, have a little bit of time to wait. And this will be where the student can access the file. They enter the subject and the class, search, the, search for the document in question, and if it is found, the result will say as such. All right, that brings us to the end of our presentation. Thank you all who are in attendance right now, giving us the time to display our advertisement. If there are any questions, you can take them now. Uh, right now we are in the work of creating a, basically a rough mock-up for it. Right now we are solely doing it in code so that we can actually have just a rough idea of how the app is supposed to function. We plan on going a little bit further with that to try and maybe implement a more realistic version of the app. But right now we are just trying to ensure that the that all of the ideas that we want to implement into the app are actually manageable and that we are capable of actually carrying them out. Any other questions? Well, that is all. Thank you and goodbye.